Everybody here? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right, uh, let's begin. Uh, where's Kamala? Um, <laughs> she's under the table looking oh. for a pearl necklace. Oh, <laughs> what's she doing under there? Um, <laughs> Her uh, job. Kamala, come out from under the table. Uh, yeah, come up for air, Kamala. No, 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 no. Just, just, just let her finish what she's doing. Yeah, let her uh, finish. She's got her hands uh, full, Nancy. <laughs> Can we get down to business, please? Uh, uh, is Kamala okay? Oh, yeah. Of course she's fine. <laughs> she's got her knee pads on. So, Kevin. Yeah? Are you going to play on our team or not? I don't know. What team are you oh, on? Oh, yeah. I'm on the money team. We're all on the money train. Oh. Isn't that right, Chuck? Yeah. Don't stop. Oh, yeah, don't God. stop. Yeah, the money train never oh. stops. Choo choo. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we could be the next silent if we try hard enough. Yeah. True. In fact, we should all be taking notes on what silent is doing right now. I agree. And we need to shut down Twitter, too. Oh. We can't allow these peasants oh. to have free speech. So, oh. Kevin, are you in or are you out? I don't know. I told everyone I was going to fire Ilhan Chef and Swalwell. So what? I say stuff all the time. <laughs> Nobody cares. Yeah, I, I say stuff all the time. No, nobody even knows what I'm saying. He's right, Kevin. Nobody cares. But don't Republicans care? Are you serious? serious? I don't know. <laughs> Kevin, if the Republicans cared, they would do something. Yeah. But they don't. They just turn the other cheek and let us do whatever we want. <laughs> but they are doing some things, aren't they? I don't know. That's Mitch. <laughs> yeah, the Republicans are doing a great job. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they let me get elected. <laughs> That's a good one, Joe. What? What did I say? Mm. Oh. The bottom line is this. If the Republicans were going to do something, they would have done it already. Yeah, we've been doing this for a long time. Yeah, so is oh. Kamala. the money side, Whoa. Kevin. We'll Whoa. take good care of you. Oh. Oh. You really think I should? Yeah. Free ice cream, free stock chips, free everything. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, what do I have to do? You just do whatever we tell you to do. <laughs> it's super easy. We'll make you speaker of the house and... We'll all continue to be filthy rich and powerful. <laughs> what do you say? Uh, can you take my order? What? <laughs> I'm speaking waitress. Don't you understand? You're, you're supposed to say, can I take your order? Yeah. Why would I take your order? <laughs> you're not the boss of me. <laughs> Whatever. Just give me a bottle with some vodka in it. <laughs> and and I'll, uh, I'll get the free taxpayer's eggs benedict, please. And for the racist? I'll just have another glass of liberal teas. <laughs> <laughs> he totally wants to date me. Trading cards? Really? What's wrong with that? America's a mess, and you're selling trading cards? Yeah, so? So? How dare you? Nobody wants a stupid card, Trump. Well, you ordered five of them. Hey, <laughs> that was supposed to be confidential. <laughs> uh, the ego on you, Trump. You should be more concerned with helping America, like us. Yeah, you're nothing but a grifter, getting rich off peasants. My, 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 how quickly you all forget. Forget what? Yeah, you never helps America. You only help yourself. Yep. Apparently you forgot how I donated every single payroll check to America for four years. So what? Anyone can have done that. Yeah, anybody could do that. You never did nothing for America. I tried. You wouldn't let me. Oh, yeah? Yeah. What did you try to do, Trump? Ha, this should be good. Remember when I asked for five billion dollars to finish the wall? Yeah, yes. Well, how come you couldn't give me the five billion to build the wall? Because we didn't have takes off. Ha! I'm Joe Biden. You know, your favorite president? <laughs> the guy who got more votes than Obama? The president that's better than Washington, Lincoln, Reagan, and Trump put together? The guy who raised gas prices, inflation, and minimum wage? The man responsible for emptying grocery store shelves and keeping that border wide open. The dictator who single-handedly laundered more money than Scrooge McDuck has got a major announcement just for you. For a limited time only, America will finally be able to see all of my accomplishments. That's right. For the first time in American history,
century, I'm doing something that no one has ever done before. I'm selling trader cards. And for the low, low price of just $500 each, you could have one of my amazing collectible trader cards for only five payments of just $1,400. That's cheaper than the 2020 election. But wait, that's not all. For just a measly extra 400 bucks, you can get three of my trader cards absolutely free with only four payments of just $600. That's a 25 cent value for only 1700 bucks. And because these babies are coming from China, I'm throwing a booster absolutely free with only two payments of just $600. That's a $14 value for only 1200 bucks. Finally, America will be able to hold all of my accomplishments in the palm of their hands. Eat one before they're all gone. Trade them with friends or sell them to other countries for $500,000 a piece. With my new Joe Biden trader cards, the sky's the limit. Get yours today. Bankman Fries, you got a visitor. What's that? <laughs> Hi, Sam. Uh, hey, Hillary. Hey, Maxine. Are you guys here to bail me out? Not exactly. Yeah, not exactly. Let me make sure these cameras are working. So you're not here to bail me out? No, Sam. We're not going to bail you out. <laughs> you ain't going nowhere. So if you're not here to bail me out, then what are you? Oh. Yep. Yep. Hillary, Maxine, I, I swear I won't talk. I promise. Oh, I know you're not going to talk, Sam. You ain't going to say nothing to no one, no more. Oh, would you look at that? <laughs> What's wrong, Nancy? Well, the cameras, they aren't working. That's weird. That, that is weird. Same thing happened in my house. It happened in Jeffrey's cell, too. Must be some kind of a coincidence. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. a coincidence for sure. Please, guys, don't do this. Hey, what's going on out there? What's with all the noise? Go back to sleep, Michael. I'll be with you in a minute. Have I been elected president yet? Does anyone need a donation? Everybody shut up! Hey, tell Stormy I said hi. Hey, can I go back to the Bahamas now? Sure! Yeah. Really? Yeah, as soon as you sign this, you can go wherever you want. <laughs> what is it? It's your goodbye letter. What? Goodbye, Sam! Yeah, goodbye, Sam! See you later, buddy. God! <laughs> tell Jeffrey I said no hard feelings! <laughs> Somebody help! Farewell, old friend! Hey, Maxine, are, are you gonna grab his wallet? Of course I'm gonna grab his wallet! You act like I ain't never grabbed a wallet! I before. was only asking! This ain't my first barbecue! Miss <laughs> Pelosi, to the best of your knowledge, tell us what happened that day. I remember like it was yesterday. I was doing what I always do. Caring for America. Hello, kind sir. How can I help you? You can start by giving me all your money. This is MAGA country. We were horrified. He kept screaming, this is MAGA country. He made us read the Constitution and, ah, and he tried to inject everyone ah, with bleach. I thought I was going to die. He poured bleach on me and made me say the Pledge of Allegiance. I just wanted to order a Diet Coke. <laughs> so there I was, riding my bike to the Capitol. When all of a sudden... You're all under my control! He said if we didn't do what he wanted, his best friend Ray Epps was gonna pay us all a visit. Do what I say, or I swear I'm gonna call my best buddy Ray Epps! I never felt so helpless before. I felt like I stepped on a bee. I could barely move, but I knew I had to do something. So I took the law into my own hands. Hey, punk! What? Put the bleach down and get out of here! Who's gonna make me? Me! That's who. Oh, yeah? Yeah. You in what army? This army. Yeah. I, like, almost died that day. Get out and stay out. All right, I'm sorry. I'll leave. Yeah, you better leave. He was totally trying to date me. Damn racist. <laughs> so, did he leave? Yeah, he left. And then he stole the limousine and screamed, This is MAGA country. Well, he just showed us on the front lawn. This is MAGA country. It was the darkest day. In American history. All right, time to upload this Twitter dossier. Hmm, who could that be? Hello? President of Twitter, Elon Musk? Who is it? It's the cable guy. Hmm, there's nothing wrong with my cable. Did I say cable? I meant Domino's. That's strange. I don't remember ordering a pizza. Can you sign for this suicide, I mean FedEx package? I'm not expecting a package. I'm from PG&E. Do you smell gas? No. Somebody call for a taxi? I didn't call for a taxi. DoorDash! I didn't order DoorDash. It's Publisher's Clearinghouse. Here's your check for a million dollars. But I'm already a billionaire. Do you have a few moments to talk about our Lord and Savior? Not with you. Yeah, <laughs> 911, how can I help you? <laughs> Hello, police? Yes? There's a crazy woman outside trying to Clinton me. Send the FBI now! 
All right. Um, we'll we, we send somebody over right now. <laughs> FBI! I have a search warrant! Uh. Oh, excuse me. Sorry about that. We have breaking news. The twice impeached President Donald Trump's son, Donald Jr., viciously assaulted a group of innocent victims in an elevator just seconds ago. Breaking news! Donald Trump's criminal son, Donald Jr., assaults a crowd of people. Investigations are underway as the world waits in fear. Breaking news! President Biden has just declared a state of emergency as the manhunt for Donald Trump Jr. continues. A candlelight vigil will be held tonight in memory of the survivors. It was horrible. Um, I mean, what, what kind of society are we living in? When you can't let me get into an elevator without being burnt, John. You can tell he was on a mission. He just stood there and burnt. People like that belong in prison. From what I remember, it sounded like a Russian burp. I'm like a survivor. But I almost died. And I think he was staring at my butt. He so wanted to date me. What kind of monster would do something like this? I blame his father. They both belong in prison. This is truly the darkest day in American history. You don't want to know what we went through. Donald Trump Jr.? Yeah? FBI, you're under arrest. Breaking news! Elevator terrorist Donald Trump Jr. has been arrested and charged with assault. The district attorney is pushing for the death penalty. And in other news, Hunter Biden made another amazing video. Way to go, buddy. Free! Oh, man, I just pooped my pants. Um, uh, did you take the suitcase? No, <laughs> they took it, you silly belly. Well, uh, who's, who's they? Them. Uh, who, who's they? Are, you're uh, looking right at them. No, uh, we're looking at you. No, <laughs> you're looking right at them. I, I, I'm confused. Did I just poop my pants or did you? Oh, my gosh. You're, like, totally looking at them. But, but, but the stolen luggage is in front of you. No, the stolen luggage is in front of them. The, 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 the stolen luggage is in front of who? Yeah. Them, silly. I, I don't see anybody but you. No, you see them. <laughs> I, I, I don't see anything. Can, can you show me where they are so I can arrest them for stealing the luggage? Or? Right here. Where? I, I can't see them. You're looking right at them. I can't see yeah, them. Yeah, I can't see them either. Where, where, uh, 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 where are they? Yeah. Right here. Look, we just need to know who's in the suitcase. Did you take it? No, they did. Who is they? <laughs> yeah, who, who, who is they? Them. Well, where are they at? <laughs> right in front of you, silly. There, there, there's nobody here but us and you. No, there's nobody here but you and them. Uh, am I drunk? Uh, I, I, I don't know. I, I, am I Joe? We're, we're going to have to get Special Agent Fetterman and Detective AOC to figure this one out. <laughs> Thank you all for joining me tonight. What is this all about? I know that I've made a lot of promises. But I promise that I'll make this promise the promise of all promises. That is my promise. <laughs> oh, is this about Fang Fang? Is this about the Standard Hotel? Is this about my racist comments? Three of you will be voted off the committee today. <laughs> hey, is this because I'm a national security risk? Is this because of my uh, witch hunts and my abuse of power and all my uh, lies? Is this because I defunded the uh, police and married my bros people? I'm going to pick three names out of the Make America Great Again box. <laughs> hey, can we hurry this up? Fang Fang's in bed waiting for me. Yeah, my Ugh. pasta and hot dogs are getting cold. This is racist. Why are you only attacking me? Eric, you're voted off the committee. <laughs> oh, this isn't fair. Oh, I'm going to tell my Chinese spy girlfriend about this. Adam, you're voted off the committee. Oh, me and my imaginary whistleblower. They're going to make something up about you and take you to court. Ilhan. You're voted off the committee. This is racist! Firing me because I'm a woman of color! This isn't right! My brosbin is not going to be happy about this! AOC, you know what to do! Pack your shit! You're all fired! Coming up next week! <laughs> Please don't fire me, bro! I <laughs> promise I'll start acting like a Republican! <laughs>